In this demonstration, we're going to show how you can copy a pocket hole along an edge. Let's go ahead and display the uh, woodworking tool set and select the pocket hole feature tool. And we're going to create a pocket hole one inch from the edge with a tip diameter of a quarter inch, a drill diameter of half an inch, and a depth of half an inch on a piece of wood that is 12 by 8 by one inch thick. Uh, let's go ahead and select the edge that we want our pocket to go along and we're going to select the face that it will start out through. And you can see it went ahead and created our, our, our pocket hole. Now let's, uh, let's demonstrate how the gripper can be used to copy one or more instances of this, this pocket hole feature. So we're going to select the, the deep select tool and uh, let's select all the faces associated with the feature and let's move it down, copy it, move it along anywhere. We're just going to move it anywhere because we're going to go back and use our, our data entry fields to put it exactly where we want it. And since uh, we put this at one inch from the edge, it's eight inches uh, long. Let's uh, specify six inches here. And so that would be one inch away from the other edge. Now let's undo that. And this time, let's create multiple copies of it. And what we'll do is we'll select the faces associated with the feature that we want to copy. And hold down the Option or Control key. Slide it out. And this time we're going to select one inch and we're going to copy it six times. And so there you can see each of our, our pockets are now copied along that edge. And note this is, a, this is an associative pattern copy where if we go back to the original feature that has the uh, pocket uh, parameters, and let's change the um, Let's change the tip diameter, divide it by two, and let's change the drill diameter, divide it by two, and then let's change the uh, pattern spacing. Let's make it 1.2 and with five copies. Thank you.